Hello, everybody. My name is Eric D. Johnson, also known as Bright Shine. I live in the city of Memphis, state of Tennessee, in the county sheriff. And today's date is early Sunday morning, May 17, 2015. And the time is 1.55 a.m. I want to first say thank you to all my fans and my supporters for your continued encouragement and support. Continue to keep myself employed. And I'm coming down here in South Haven, Mississippi. Uh, Chef had an amazing service home. Uh, right there on some uh, Mitchell Drive. And uh, I'm going to continue to further my education at Monroe College online. Study, uh, pursuing my associate's degree. Studying business administration with a concentration in marketing. And uh, I'm going to continue to. Uh, On this uh, legal matter that I have. Matter of fact, I've, I've been in consultation with my uh, attorney, the Hewlett Law Firm, and I appreciate all the work that the Hewlett Law Firm is doing and uh, we're in the process of holding a uh, one sound studio accountable. And Paul Wynn, also, he go by the name of Lou, he was assuming that he had got away. Was stealing some money from me. Well, I talked to my attorney about that, and uh, he hadn't got away. Because all my fans, my support, when you see all the things that's being done at One Sound Studio, don't never assume that Carlos Williams, that go by the name Luga, has been left sitting out here on the street, and that there's no, that there's nothing being done about the wrong that he done. Because there is things being done legally. When you talk to your attorney, then that's what I'm doing. Legally, I'm doing something about Carlos Williams. They go by the name Lou. And uh, so on that on that note, I want to thank all my fans, my support, for continuing encouragement support. And matter of fact, I'm not even be alone on this video because a lot of things have been done by African traditional religion. And uh. We're going to continue to talk about African traditional religion. But what we're at the stage now is that each individual person needs to take the uh, necessary steps to get in contact with the people that teach African traditional religion at these institutions of higher learning, at these universities and colleges in Sub Saharan Africa. And, uh, such as in the uh, African nation of Nigeria or Ghana, or uh, you, know, you, you can go to uh, Senegal, Sierra Leone, Guinea, you can go to uh, uh, Liberia, you, you can go to you know, all over West Africa, you can go to Cameroon, Central African Republic. You know, they all have schools. You go to the Great Lakes school in the Great Lakes area, Kenya, Tanzania, Uganda. You can go to uh, 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 Rwanda. They have a problem in Rwanda, in Burundi. But however, you can go to Zaire, Congo. You can go to Angola, Mozambique. You can go to South Africa. You can go to Zimbabwe, Zambia. I swung, you name any African country in, in Sub Saharan Africa that teach African traditional religion. And they will teach you African traditional religion at these institutions of higher learning, these universities, colleges. So, including myself, we were, we were looking at these downloads. Uh, but these, these writers of these downloads, these colleges and universities, they, they, they write about African traditional religion. And you can get this information and be online. And they have an email address. And you know, like myself, I work every day trying to go to school sometimes. You know, it takes time for you to actually sit down and, and, and you know, uh, write a correspondence. But when you get time, get in contact with the Institute of Higher Learning. Get in contact with the individual and uh, 
get all the information you can about uh, enrolling and attending the institution that I learned. They teach African traditional religion in Sub Saharan Africa. And uh, African traditional religion is being taught or trying to learn. Get in contact with these institutions that I learned so they can teach about African traditional religion. And uh, like I said, I'm not going to be long on this video. We're going to continue to talk about African traditional religion indefinitely. So, uh, again, I want to thank all my fans, my support, for your continued encouragement and support. Again, my name is Eric D. Johnson, also known as Brashai. Live right here in the city of Memphis, the state of Tennessee, and the county of Shelby. And uh, until my next video, I'm going to wish each and every one of you very best. Take care of yourself.